and everything is a lot better. Amen. What we need is an old-fashioned revival That's right. in your heart, and it'll cause you to have those pure thoughts and clean living and make you make decisions that will honor the Lord and make you feel good at night when you rest because you stood for God. Oh, it's so amazing what the Lord can do, praise God, if we, we as God's people just get our mind on Jesus. That, that would take care of the problem for all of us people because if you have the Amen. mind of Christ, oh, if that yeah. mind is in you, mm. then you're going to be caring about people. Not, not money right. and not my fleshly desires. Right. Listen, I care more about people than I do my own satisfying, oh. my, my gratifications in my own life. Right. I, I, we ought to think about others. And I think that's, uh, that's the hurt right now. And you see, and one more time, the statistics, all the facts are here. And you can't argue these facts. Exactly. exactly. They're real. And they tell it everywhere. And it's the same for her. So, her, her. so please, please, get involved. Don't just stand outside. You know somebody said, now, Brother Billy, you know you're a Whitley County pastor. Yes, I pastor the Mount Nash Baptist Church in Whitley County. Mm -hmm. We're not in Williamsburg or Corbin. But, but wait a minute, friend. I told our folks in, that down in Williamsburg, when your neighbor's house is on far, mm -hmm. Jonathan, you better react because Dang. yours is going to be next. That's exactly right. And, you know, if they legalize all this drinking and, and packing houses and stuff, how long until they start trying to... Uh, uh, vote us out and saying we're illegal to preach in public. We're illegal to carry our Bibles in public. How long till that happens, Pastor? Well, you know, if you keep going this direction, mm -hmm. then you know it's going to get to where uh, you, you, you're going to have more come again your church. Oh, my and goodness. And again, the people of God that's taking a bold right. stand against sin. Right. You, you, it's going to happen. So... You know, I, I just hope and pray that the good people in the early, and we got good people. I, I know we got good people. Yeah, yeah. We really do. There's some wonderful people watching this. Maybe some of them, it's, it's, it's been getting a little bit led astray, mm -hmm. uh, but they're seeing it. I believe their heart's going to run, bring them back. I believe the Spirit of Almighty God will get you back into the Word of God, and uh, just a few days of revival in your life will cause you to see things a whole lot different. And you know what's such a sad situation that we're living in, and I know you've seen it too. When you get up here to the bigger cities and regions, you'll see a big church here, but a saloon right beside of it. Mm. Or an adult bookstore right beside of it. You know, that will be how this area is if this Terrible. is voted in. It will just go from bad to worse. Yeah. And nobody can convince me, hey, this is going to do something for the community, for the county, except just demolish it. <laughs> well, it, you know, it, it's not going to help. Uh, I, I can show you here that money-wise, it's going to cost. Mm -hmm. They say, well, it's going to help me personally some way. Uh, but is that all you're concerned about? Mm -mm. You're concerned about yourself and you sitting down to eat and you're wanting to drink. Or you say, well, I'm going to get a bigger restaurant coming. You really believe that? Mm -mm. You do, do you really? Has it happened in Corbin? You no. know, is it, is it going to happen? Is it, is it going to be worth the heartache and sorrow that these statistics and these facts right here that's been proved shows? I don't think so. Right. You know, it's just like an old song that I heard. What's wrong with living right? <laughs> What's wrong with living right? What's wrong with having morals and values? It seems like people today, if you've got a little uh, morals about yourself and want to do the right thing, they think you're weird. They think you're strange. Oh, you're not with it, man. You're not with the, the in crowd. I don't want to be with the in crowd. I want to be with the Lord. Right. It's, you know, it's just the right thing to do right. is try to make sure that our communities are protected and keeps a good standard of right living, mm. clean living, and pure lives. Exactly. And, and, and that's what saying no would do. The more you allow, then it's going to expand and get mm. worse and just the morals is going to decay. Mm. Uh, lives is going to be uh, more devastated as it. Uh, you know, I, I'm just hoping and praying that uh, the good people in the hurry will become involved right. and will go out. And those that are able and those that are not able, like myself, think I will be voting in any of these. But I will be helping those. And the reason for that is I just told you, I can see the hurt that's there mm -hmm. that's going to come toward me. So I better help them before it gets right. there. It's going to happen. So I'm going to try to put the fire out in my, my neighbor's house 
before that fire keeps raging bigger and bigger. And, and spreads. It gets, gets, yeah, and spreads to us all. Well, I am so thankful, uh, Reverend Billy, that you have took the time to come down and be with us and discuss this with us today. We're running out of time. But, you know, one sobering thought for people that one thing leads to another thing. Yes. And there's going to be consequences. There will be consequences for this. But we thank you, and we're so thankful for what you're doing. We appreciate you and the Mount Ash Baptist Church for even taking the time to come in and be with us. Amen. Can we say a prayer in closing? Let's today? do that. Let's do that. All right. We're going to pray in our closing. Father in heaven, Lord in this Jesus is such name. an important issue, Lord, God, help the because it can to make the concerns right people and families. Yes. And, the, and her, her age yes, and her people around us. And Lord, I pray today that you'll help. Yes. And Lord, send a revival yes, to Lord. the Barberville, to the Corbin, Lowell County, and Whitley, and Wimsburg. Lord, for that people one more time mm. would come back to that good walk of enjoying yes. you, dear Lord Jesus, and the good Holy Spirit. Oh. Uh, God, it certainly makes our life a joy feel like. Thank you, Lord. And that we might stand for right, love you, yes. reach our lost people, you, help Lord. them to be saved, make it to heaven, and have a joyful life. Oh, Father, give us a good area of a great atmosphere with a good, clean, protected Christian environment that's made living so yes, wonderful Lord. down through these years in this area. May it happen and continue to do it. In Jesus' name we Amen. pray. Amen. Amen. Join us next